Hello! So it is time for another unboxing and today it is the November Book Box Club. I'm very excited for this and it's actually a really good box. I've been a bit meh about these boxes the last few months and I think that might be partly because of the mood I've been in and like I've not really been into the items but this box is a really good box and I'm very excited for the book as well so I'm going to open it up so if you don't want to see what's in here stop watching now. So the theme for November is secret societies and oh look at this artwork this is one thing I always absolutely adore about the boxes no matter what the book is no matter what the items are I always love the artwork on the spoiler card it's just always so good. So the first item is this little patch which says Hamden College Classics Department. I absolutely love this and I am actually collecting patches because I do want to get a denim jacket and put all these patches on. I have been saying that for about two years now and I haven't done it but maybe eventually I will and if I do this will go on it because I really like this. Next up, we have this coaster, which is absolutely gorgeous. I absolutely adore this. And I don't know if you can read that, but it says we are all stardust. Oh, I can't talk. It says we are all stardust and stories. And it's just really cute. I... This is actually inspired by the Starless Sea, which I have not read and probably won't read. But this is a pretty coaster and I do absolutely love this. Next up, we have this little um, this little key biscuit thing. Mine is broken, but I mean, it was going to get broken when I eat it anyway. But this is Key to the Clubhouse Orange Flavoured Belgian Chocolate Key with Sugar Crunch. Guys, this ain't going to make it past filming this video because, oh, this looks so good. And I'm very excited to try it. <laughs> so um, this will be eaten very soon. Next up is this adorable little notebook which has the unashamedly bookish design on it so I have the book box club top that has this design on it and now I have a notebook I love these little notebooks as well they're really handy for like shopping lists and stuff you know when I actually used to leave the house back in uh, the day those are the days but no, this is really handy for like just little lists and things because obviously it's quite a small notebook. But yeah, just little notes and lists and I really like this and it's a really nice material. I can't even describe what the material is on the outside, but I really like this. And then the final item before the book is this little pouch which has a little clip and you can put books in there, notebooks, anything you want. And this is actually, um, the design is actually inspired by the actual book in this box, which I am going to show you now. So the book in this box is The Magpie Society by Zoe Sugg and Amy McCulloch. So I am so excited for this book. So I, I love Amy McCulloch's, um, jinxed series i've only read the first book but i love it and i'm excited to read the second book and i'm not gonna lie i dnf'd girl online but i'm very excited oh <laughs> this is the little signed book plate but i'm very excited to read this it sounds so good and look at those end papers they're so pretty and look at that mm -hmm. it's so pretty so yeah, I'm very excited to read this. It's been on my radar for a while and when Bookbox Club released the theme announcement for the November box, I read it and I instantly knew it was this book and I was like, yes! So I was very excited for this box, but I am going to read you the blurb. A student found dead on the beach, a web of unanswered questions, someone poised to strike again. To new student Audrey Wagner, alumnum high is a mystery. The students scuttle around the echoing halls like they're afraid of something. Her new roommate, Ivy, is acting strangely. And what's with the school's weird obsession with magpies? To straight A star, Ivy Moore Zhang, alumna hall is home. In fact, Ivy has big plans for this year and she doesn't need a new roommate cluttering up her space, especially one who starts poking her nose in other people's business. But then the summer's tragic incident is wrenched to the fore with a mysterious podcast airs with one sinister headline, I know who killed Lola and one of you is next. Like, yeah, 
this it sounds so good i really like the sound of this i don't know why i sung that <laughs> like it sounds really good and i'm very excited to read this so there's that so that was my unboxing um favorite item wise i i don't really like picking the food items in boxes as my favorite because it's not something that will last so I would say the key, but I'm not going to. I'm going to say the little coaster. I really love the coaster and it's like the cork back and mm, yes, it's just so pretty and I love it. So that was my unboxing. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. As always with my unboxings, I will put the names of all the artists and shops in the description box below and I will see you next time. Bye.